we got going on tonight. Yeah, we do, Conan. That's right. We've got a good show tonight. I we like tonight's show. There are nights when I look at the show and I'm like, we don't got it tonight. <laughs> and you don't care because you've been drinking. And uh, tonight I think we have a very good one. I think our chances of having a good show are fair to Midland. And uh, it's pretty good for us. Yes. I always come out and say a quick hello to uh, the audience before the show starts. Sometimes I meet interesting people with interesting stories. Say hello to a gentleman right now who... Uh, what is this? You, you skipped... You skipped out today. Is this right, sir? You skipped out today. You missed, you're missing four classes and two tests. How many tests are you missing right now? Two tests. Four classes, two tests. Now, I could see... I could see missing four classes. You tell buddies or pals or chums, hey, just give me, I have the notes when you're done. Two tests, that takes guts. <laughs> you're my hero. <laughs> and when your professors see this on television tonight, <laughs> it's all over. <laughs> okay. Well, you always have a job here if you get in trouble. If this gets you in trouble, you can have any, you can be in the band with any of these guys. Or... <laughs> Half of them don't read music anyway. Look at La Bamba. <laughs> Look at La Bamba. La Bamba. <laughs> that was beautiful. We, we caught La Bamba holding sheet music up to Jimmy saying, what is this stuff? <laughs> what do these mean? I just blow and suck. <laughs> You can have his job. <laughs> Whatever you want it. <laughs> Start now. Um, all right. Man, I do love this job. Wouldn't you say that's true, Manx? Absolutely. Oh, what a weird response. Uh, no, it's true. I do love this job. I enjoy it yes, thoroughly. I come out here night after night, and my favorite part is I get to talk to so many fascinating people. Think about it. Uh, entertainers, athletes, politicians, they come out, they sit here in this chair, old Bessie Lou. <laughs> And we talk. The problem is, they're never here long enough for me to really get to know them. What's the average interview? Six, seven minutes, and then they're gone. Well, I wanted to find out more about these celebrities, really probe their minds. So I mailed out a questionnaire to America's <laughs> Biggest Stars. True story. I wrote up the questions myself, addressed the envelopes, mailed them out. I didn't think I'd hear back from a lot of celebrities because they're such busy people. A surprising number responded to the quiz. Tonight, we're going to show you their answers in a segment we call Celebrity Survey. Here's how the survey works. We asked three celebrities to complete a phrase. Our first phrase was, the most distinguished looking man I ever met was, Bill Clinton wrote Jack Kennedy. That's very cool. Bob Dole wrote Ronald Reagan. George W. Bush wrote, my mom. <laughs> She's a tough broad. Uh, well, Mahmoud uh, Ahmadinejad's anti-Semitic rhetoric reminds me of Al Franken wrote Hitler. Al Roker wrote Farrakhan. Mel Gibson wrote My Wedding Toast. <laughs> He won't be on this show anytime soon. <laughs> um, my favorite sport is Senator Christopher Dodd wrote baseball. Senator Chuck Schumer wrote football. Senator Larry Craig wrote stall hockey. <laughs> you played it? It's fun. Surprisingly fun sport. Uh, <laughs> I like to surprise my kids by, Matt Lauer wrote, coming home from work early. Ben Stiller wrote, buying them presents. Britney Spears wrote, not puking on them. <laughs> the question I am most often asked is, Jennifer Connelly wrote, what are you working on? Cameron Diaz wrote, will you read my screenplay? O.J. Simpson wrote, 
why are you stabbing me? <laughs> In high school, I had to choose between hanging out with, Harrison Ford wrote, my buddies or my girlfriend. Tom Arnold wrote, the jocks or the nerds. Larry King wrote, the pterodactyls or the trilobites. <laughs> As an old man. <clears throat> On weekends, you can probably find me, Samuel L. Jackson wrote playing golf. Martha Stewart wrote gardening. Max Weinberg wrote practicing my handicapped parking space limp. <laughs> bad guy. Uh, if you want to look like I do, Halle Berry wrote, drink lots of water and sleep eight hours. Giselle Bundchen wrote, don't drink alcohol after eight. Joan Rivers wrote, throw a bucket of pink stucco at a high power fan. <laughs> Man, that was rough. Man, that was rough. And finally, when I'm feeling randy, I like to... Jessica Alba wrote, make love in a bathtub. Jeff Goldblum wrote, do it standing up. Michael Jackson wrote, remind Randy, it's our little secret. Stick around.